listing agents, uh, Charlie and Lindsay Zhu, and the rest of the team from the professionals at Juan Turner. We'd like to welcome you all here this morning. And uh, we'd also like to take this opportunity of publicly thanking our vendors for entrusting us with this magnificent opportunity here today. The printed form of contract that we're selling from here this morning is that printed form as set out by the Law Institute and the Real Estate Institute of Victoria. Copies of this contract and its annexures have been available for your inspection prior to today. And I would hope that either you or your solicitor have made full inquiry on the property answered all the questions you need to ask and satisfied yourselves as to what you are buying. Within that printed form of contract is a reference to the sale of land regulations 2014 and the auction conditions contained therein, of which there are mandatory announcements to be made by the auctioneer and they are as follows. The auction will be conducted in accordance with the rules and any additional conditions that were made available for inspection before the start of the auction. The auction rules prohibit an auctioneer from accepting bids or offers for a property after the property has been knocked down to the successful bidder. I will indicate bidders on request. The law prohibits false bids, major disruptions by bidders and bidders attempting to prevent others from bidding and provides fines for this conduct. To indicate that I am making a bid on behalf of the vendor during the auction, I will say the words vendor bid. And by law, only I as the auctioneer can make a vendor bid. You're ended the lesson. Uh, Meridian lawyers are the vendor's legal representatives. They prepared the contract in its entirety and described the property as number four Excel Court here in Wonturna South. Its legal description being lot three under plan of subdivision PS. 323-777-G, Certificate of Title, Volume 10149, Folio 804. Included with the purchase of the property are all fixed floor coverings, light fittings, window uh, furnishings, dishwasher, air conditioner and all fittings and fixtures of a permanent nature. And the late inclusion, ladies and gentlemen, are the two TVs, one in the master bedroom and the other one, Lindsay, down the back of the property that are mounted on the wall in the AV. Hello, Jess. So uh, you've got two inclusions there uh, as a late inclusion there, ladies and gentlemen. Benefit to you, of course. 10% deposit is required on the floor of the hammer. In this case, slap of the contract in my hand. A very flexible 90 to 120 day settlement has been nominated. So plenty of time to get your affairs in order there. Very straightforward contract, special conditions, nothing strange there. Zoning is uh, general residential zone two. We have copies of council and water rates there, certificate of land tax, diagram of sanitary drainage, a search on behalf of Vic Roads, which is clear, all services available and connected to the property and vacant possession is given to you on completion or at settlement. Are there any questions? That's it. Nope. Fantastic. Well, we're offering to you, ladies and gentlemen, some 756 square metres of land in what I would describe as one of the most immaculate properties I've had the privilege of auctioning over my 30 years. You walk inside, everything is pristine, be it inside or outside. Be it the bedrooms, the living room, the decor, the gardens, it is all pristine. And I really must uh, commend the vendors on the presentation of the home. And uh, it is a full family, two daughters living at home, ladies and gentlemen. So uh, plenty of activity hang uh, uh, in the, uh, the house itself. And with that, it is absolutely immaculate. Not throughout the, the marketing period, but that's just the way they live. And I think an absolute credit to them. And uh, we wish them all the best with that here today. The uh, subdivision here, ladies and gentlemen, uh, as uh, many of you will know, and I know we've got a lot of the neighbours here, and I welcome you. Uh, thank you. It was black and one sugar. <coughs> Hard to get uh, good help. Uh, the subdivision here, ladies and gentlemen, obviously all of the homes around the same age. Uh, the subdivision here, I don't know whether you know, but it was owned by the Catholic Church way back when. And Excel Court was actually named after the business manager and trust manager for uh, the Catholic Church of the Diocese of Melbourne, who put together uh, the subdivision on behalf of the church. So a little bit of history there for you. We are surrounded by lovely homes in the area and hasn't 
One turn of south just gone through the roof. Absolutely fantastic, but it's no surprise. Good quality homes, good quality and good sized blocks of land and uh, handy location to everything that is Knox City right beside us. The home itself has a mixture of formal and informal living areas. Uh, the bedrooms are all zoned on the right hand side of the home as we go down. Master bedroom with uh, full walk in robe there, ensuite uh, bathroom. And then we go down to uh, the second and third bedrooms with that uh, main bathroom and a feature of the day. And you always knew you were uh, uh, walking into a high quality home when you had the spa bath in the corner of the bathroom there, nice and big still functioning and uh, a great place to relax after a hard day's work on shore. Down the back of the property on that right hand side we've got the fourth bedroom there but it's the second bedroom with an ensuite and walk-in road there as well. To the left hand side as we look at the property we've got that formal lounge, nice big room there, you've got informal entertaining area on the other side of that wall and those rooms around there and around the kitchen looking out onto that uh, wonderful alfresco area, I'll come to that shortly. But as we move down, we've got the meals area, a family room or rumpus room. You've got the bonus of having a study or an office uh, at the back of the property there. Good sized laundry, as I mentioned, the main bathroom, excellent size there as well. Good sized bedrooms, it's light, it's bright, it's airy right the way through and you couldn't want for a better property. But how about those landscape grounds? You've got the alfresco area that I mentioned there, ladies and gentlemen. I did forget to say that the property was featured uh, in the localrealestate.com. Here it is here. Thank you very much, my assistant. <laughs> Used to work on sale of the century. Um, you've got the alfresco area there, fully covered in, fully landscaped, ladies and gentlemen. I do like those three panels uh, on the ground that are in there as well and fully landscaped out the back of the home there with the trees, the lemon tree, uh, everything you would want. You're not only getting that, but you're also getting two sheds down the side and the cubby house there as well, along with the double lock-up garage as we come in the driveway. It's a quiet court. Uh, hands up the neighbours. Hands up the neighbours. Lovely neighbours. And I can see just by the way that you greeted one another today and walking around, uh, good community spirit here within uh, Excel Court and you all get on very, very well as, in, indeed, which is, uh, is lovely to see and very important when the family moves into the area. Where are we? Well, we're right next to Knox City. Why would you want to be anywhere else? You could walk from here and uh, you've got Ozone with the cinemas, the restaurants, all the shopping facilities, some great restaurants there, ladies and gentlemen. Uh, you've got the squash courts and the, uh, the gym just down the road there as well. A myriad of shops, you couldn't want to be in a better place, handy location and uh, with East Link just down the road you can get to anywhere in Melbourne in a matter of minutes getting down there as well. So there we have it ladies and gentlemen, great place, great location, good schools in the area there. I'm looking to you now for an opening bidder and offer on number 4 XL Court here at One Turner South. Should be a start of around that 950, 900 mark to start and see where we go from there. Don't be late. Looking for 900 anywhere around uh, the crowd. 900, 900 right in close. Have 900,000 dollar bid now. I'll take your 20s over and above that figure at 900,000 bid. Have 900,000 dollar bid now. Looking for 920 anywhere around the crowd at 900. Have 900,000 dollars right in close here, ladies and gentlemen, at 900 bid. Superb quality, absolutely in pristine condition. 920, 756 square metres of land. At $920,000, right in close at 920, 940. 920, 920 is there, 940 bid. At 940, 60, sir, if you want it. At 940, there's the competition, 960 bid. At 960, 980. 960, 980. 980 bid. At $980,000 now, 980. Take another 20, sir, make it 1 million if you wish. One million bid. At one million bid now, at one million. Got the juice across the road there at one million dollars. At one million dollar bid now, at one million and twenty. Would you like to make it ten? Yes. Twenty? Twenty. One million and twenty. Take a ten from you, sir. At one million and twenty. Thirty. At one million and thirty. At one million and thirty bid. One million and thirty thousand dollars. Forty. One million and forty. Fifty. One million and fifty. 
60. One million and fifty. Sixty. One million and sixty. Make it seventy soon. One million and sixty seventy bid. At one million and seventy thousand. At one million seventy thousand, one million eighty. One million and seventy thousand dollars in close now. I look for anybody else around the crowd and eighty. At one million and eighty. I'd like to round it off to one point one, sir. I'll take the ten now if you like. One point one. One million one hundred thousand dollars rounds it off at one point one. At one million one hundred thousand dollar bit now. Take a ten if you like. At one million one hundred thousand dollars right in close. Nobody else in at this stage. 1.1 million, 1.1 million, and 110, 1 million 110, and 20, sir, 120, 1 million 120, 1 million 120 thousand dollars. Obviously, ladies and gentlemen, 30? 1 million, uh, 1 million 130. 40. 40. 140. At 140. At 1 million 140,000 dollar bid now. 1 million 140,000. I was going to say, ladies and gentlemen, a little time needed, uh, particularly when uh, translating figures, etc., etc. 1 million 145. 50. 1 million 150. Just getting some instructions now. 1 million 150, 60, sir. Another 10,000. 1 million 160. 1160. 1 million 160,000 dollars. 1 million 160. 170. 170. 1 million 160. Tim. Could you just do some, uh, thank you. One million one hundred and sixty thousand dollars. Would you like five? Would you like five? Five. Yeah, one six five. One million one hundred and sixty is here. One million one hundred and sixty. And five. One sixty five. One seventy. One hundred and seventy. One million one seventy. Up one million one hundred and seventy thousand dollars. One million one seventy big. Up one million one seventy. 1 million 170 bid right here. We're very, very close indeed. Another five. Take another five. 1 million 170 thousand dollar bid out. 1 million 170. 1 million 170 we are. Young Sullivan? 1 million 170. 1 million 170. Take another five. Ladies and gentlemen, we are on the market, we are going to sell. We're on the market, we're going to sell. One million, one hundred and seventy thousand dollars, the current bid, right there to my right hand side. We're on the market, we're going to sell. You want another five? You want to make it 180? It's up to you. 80. One million, one hundred and eighty. One million one hundred and eighty. One million one hundred and eighty. Take a five or a one or two. One thousand. One million one hundred and eighty-one thousand. One million one hundred and eighty-one thousand. One thousand. One eighty-two. One eighty-five. She's in charge. At one eighty-five. One million one eighty-five. Eighty. 1 million 190? Or do you want to make it 1.2? Yeah, another 5. Another 5. 1 million 190. And 5. No? 91. 191. 191. 1 million 191. Make it 92. You in or out? 
192. 1 million 192. 1 million 193. 1 million 193. I want 94. 1 million 193 thousand dollars right here and I call it once we're selling you in or out the bids there I'm so I'm gonna sell it 1 million 193 thousand dollars first call 1 million 193,000 right here. Calling twice. 1,193,500. Another 500. One million one hundred ninety four and a half. <laughs> what? No. Five hundred. Five hundred. One ninety four and a half, yeah? One ninety four and a half. 195, says the lady. 195. 1 million 195,000 dollars. At 1,195,000, we're on the market. We're going to sell them. I call it once. At 1,195,000 dollars. Here, calling twice. You went around. Right here, ladies and gentlemen. Third. One point two. One point two. One point two. One One point two oh one. No, you're out. First call, we're selling one point two oh one right here. Second call at one million two hundred and one thousand dollars. Third, you win or out. Third call at one million two hundred and one thousand dollars or silence. Lindsay, we're out. All silent, all done. Congratulations, sir. Well done. 1.201. Ladies and gentlemen, on behalf of the professionals at Juan Turner, thank you for your attendance and spirited bidding. Congratulations to our, our uh, buyer. Congratulations to our underbidders. But of course, congratulations to our wonderful vendors. <laughs> thank you very much. If you have any inquiries, please come forward. We've been more than <clears throat> happy to answer those for you. Cheers. Oh, that's good.